this, this, dead duck, this. Derek, Mark, Tim, and I, and Brian. Brian's first duck hunt. Yeah. We don't know what we're going to do, but we brought lots of ammunition. Commence the shooting. Yep, right. commence the shooting. Here we go. Temperatures. Are we at 43? This could be worse. Yeah. Hey, I'm Brian. How you doing? Nice hey. Duck. What do we think we're shooting today? Scoter? Scooter? Yep, Scooter. go right after the ground, the ocean. We've seen a lot of different birds around. Yeah. You know, what else we should? Yeah, I mean, um, the duck season's over, but uh, I think I think it pretty much figured probably just to go. Back I got the my, ammo. I got my gloves are in there too. I'll grab them later. I'd like to, I'd like to tell you everything's dry up in here, but not. Ammo. Gotcha. Put that on tweet. Just. Right. Yeah, that's what you're gonna look like if you if you don't stop eating. <laughs> Puff Dougie. <laughs> Looks like you've gained 70 pounds and you've been to the gym. Been to the gym. I went in and got a Snickers out of the machine. Yeah. And left. Yeah. Doug, every time, every time they have like a free pizza day, that's the day you go to the gym. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> I've only been out here once just because of weather, but I think I got a half a good idea. But you know, Delaware Bay's our north, Chesapeake Bay's the south, and. There is, there is nothing sitting there. <laughs> and this is only the sea duck zone. So when sea ducks is closed, you, you, you're not supposed to, you can't, you can't shoot anything out here. Although today, duck season is open so you can shoot ducks too. It'd be nice to see a line up before I put the decoys out. The scoters are moving, but you don't really see their wings flapping. Okay. So at a distance, anything you can see is flapping. Not gonna be up there. I usually say, let him get here, let him get here, and somebody's already shooting at him. So, all right. No, I like that. <laughs> let him get here, let him get here. Hopefully, they come in and set. That's so, my preference. Yeah, and with the wind, as they come at you, sometimes they land, but as they come at you, just be prepared when they go left or right, that's about as close as they were gonna get. Okay. Ideally, the way I'm gonna set up is they should fly, pretty much give you a, a nice passing shot right over the decoys. Sure, hen would have a very black bill with uh, some yellow streaks in it. So this is you can kind of we'll get we'll probably have a mature you can you know once you see the other one you'll understand. The other thing is the white belly bird is this year's bird. Now if you look at the tail feathers, they're kind of all kind of ratty and not not 100% yet. Takes scoter three years to get 100% mature, and then they don't they don't have an eclipsing plumage, so they look like that all year long. This one you can even see see a couple of black feathers in his back. Yeah, and you can see this how his bill is is like the very first one. So that that's a drake. So really you have four drakes.
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's all wet and just sloppy. <laughs> Tied flies. But he's he's good on flies. He's quite a red meat, isn't it? It's very, very dark, and that's you see when you get it out like this, you know there's no fat on it, so it's pretty lean. It Soaks that out. Real lean, not a lot of fat. Because the fat's where you get that like nasty mm -hmm. salt kind of flavor in there. So mm -hmm. 